Now we're gonna take our hands and mix this in. Let me give you a better view from this side. So we're gonna mix it, make sure it is incorporated well and store in a cool place. Make sure that you have an airtight container. Good morning. Today I am going to make a dry rub, a sweet dry rub for some chicken. Now this could go on anything, but I am going to use it on some chicken today. So step in the kitchen with me as I put this sweet dry rub together. So we're going to start with our ingredients. I'm going to use my water. And I'm going to use one cup of sugar, brown sugar. So this is one cup of brown sugar. And I'm going to use one fourth of a cup of, of holy smoke. Okay, one fourth of a cup. And then I'm going to use two tablespoons of paprika, two tablespoons. And one tablespoon of cayenne pepper. If you want it a little more heated you can add some extra oregano I am going to add one teaspoon of oregano because oregano is very strong just one teaspoon and half teaspoon of black pepper Okay, half teaspoon of black pepper. So I have some mustache, the garlic and the herb, right? I'm gonna use one teaspoon. I can get it out. Okay, so one teaspoon, right? Uh, add a little dust extra. And Half teaspoon of white pepper. Half teaspoon. And I like to add a little bit of complete seasoning. So I'm going to add also half teaspoon of the complete seasoning. And that's it for ingredients. Now we're going to take our hands and mix this in. 
me give you a better view from this side so we're gonna mix it make sure it is incorporated well and store in a cool place make sure that you have an airtight container and store in a cool cool spot and if you're marinating your meat with this I would advise that you marinate the meat at least two to three hours before cooking cooking it so that way it will absorb more into the meat so that's how I put my quick and easy sweet dry rub together for my chicken again another closer look I hope you all have an awesome Sunday and may your week be blessed and highly favored.